if you equip it, right, so if, you're, if your warrior's actually wielding it, it won't. Mm -hmm. But if it's in your hand or deck, it's going to get the plus one attack. So it's the entire deck, so it's a super version of the smuggling mechanic since he's legendary. Uh, and like you said, he's got an awesome effect here. Yeah, pretty cool. Love it. Yeah, our art team is awesome. They did so many cool new super effects. Super sweet, man. Uh, yeah, love it. I was a xylophone player in band in high school. I don't really tell many people that. It's not, it's not something that I'm bragging about, but I, got, I, I felt a little sense of joy when I see this card being played. Nice. All right, and then of course, uh, this is one of the cards for the Grimy Goons. You can tell by the symbol in the top left. And I think that's one of the things that people, uh, you know, they don't see the, the impact immediately, but when uh -huh. it starts compounding on each other, all these buffs, it actually starts to get a little out of control, I think. Yeah, lots of power there. And uh, as you can see, since we're playing Warrior. Four two weapon for two. The uh, the symbol actually is the is always the goon symbol, but the color locks in once you start playing. Mm, Just a little mm. little note there into the warrior color behind the symbol. Mm. So then for paladin, it'd be a different color right. as well. 